Hey everyone, it's Jordan, coming at you today with another haul. I know. But this isn't just any old haul. Oh no. This is a Black Friday haul. All us shopaholics, we all love Black Friday, let's be real. All I'm gonna say is I hope you're comfy because this ish is gonna be long. What's really, really cool is clothing brands around this time of year, like Black Friday and stuff, they have some really, really good sales. So, putting down myself. I'm gonna share with you bits from Pretty Little Thing, Miss Pap, Boohoo, and In The Style. Is that everything? I think so. I'm gonna try not to talk too much, you know, pick up the pace a little bit so we can get through everything, but like this is me and I like talk for England, so. I am literally surrounded by clothes right now. I'm okay with that. But yeah, let's just do this because there's so much stuff and I don't want us to be sitting here till next year. Starting with Miss Pap, one of my fave, fave places. Anyway, the first thing from Miss Pap I have here is this jumper dress. So, I mean instantly, Gucci look alike. I love the colors, I love the white with like the pop of color. It's just a white jumper dress with the green and red stripes going through like the middle and on the sleeves as well. I got it in a size 10, which I normally wouldn't do, but I quite like the fact it gives me a bit more like comfiness and a bit more room. Do you know the plus side to this, you guys? It isn't see-through. <laughs> we all know how it is on this channel. Finding white things that aren't see-through is literally a mission. But where obviously it's more of a jumper, it's a really, really nice material. I love this sort of stuff for winter because, you know, sometimes you don't want to be covered up like head to toe. So, you know, you've got a bit of leggage on show. Not mad at it. Got like the top covered up, put a nice big coat over this. Good to go. So yeah, that's that little gem. I will of course leave everything linked below. So if you want to know pricing and everything like that, Check the description box, you guys know. Next things. Ah! I feel like this is gonna be a love it or hate it kind of item, but styled right, I think these will look so cool. They are basically wet look leggings, pretty much. I'm gonna like try my best to pull them off. No promises, but your girl can try. <laughs> they fit like a glove. And what I really, really like as well is they're super comfortable because they have stretched to them. This pair with like a white knit jumper, I feel like would be such a vibe. But hopefully you guys can see that stretch. Can you see that? I feel like people look at this and be like, oh, just because it is kind of more daring, a little bit more out there, but I feel like this can be totally, I feel like any clothing item, to be honest, can be totally wearable. It's just about how you like kind of style it. What size did I get these in? I got them in an eight. I am a size eight, so I did stick to my size. I'm so excited to give these a go. Like, so excited. Never be scared with like clothing and fashion and style and stuff, you guys, because at the end of the day, it comes off. It's like makeup, isn't it? You'll never know until you try. <laughs> Inspirational quote of the day. So this kind of jumper from Miss Pap here is the kind of jumper that I could see of them leggings. It is just this white knitted jumper, but at the front, it has like a twist. I'm gonna do it like no favors holding it up, but it basically like wraps over at the front, it's longer at the back. I don't know, it's just not like your standard knit jumper, you know, we're switching it up, we're spicing it up. Anything knitwear around this time of year, it's gonna keep you warm, which is fab, because like I said in my last haul, gets like minus a B in here in England. <laughs> really nice chunky knit white, which means it's gonna go with a lot of stuff. I got it in a size small to medium as well, and it fits perfectly. Something a little bit different, I don't have anything like it in my wardrobe, and why I really like it is, I've got loads of jumpers, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Let's be honest, around this time of year, we're like jumper cray but i just don't want the same thing all the time you know because I, I get a little bit bored so with this it's like i'm a jumper but i'm a little bit extra <laughs> it's cute right i like it i like it a lot speaking of keeping warm this coat is kind of everything now i'm going to be honest with you guys i'm not normally a like pink i mean i like pink but i'm not really a pink clothing wearer kind of girl <laughs> i don't think that was even english but this coat this coat. It is so damn cute. It is a pink kind of long line fur coat. That's sort of like sheep fur. Not real sheep, of course. Mm -mm. It's called a teddy coat. I'm literally gonna feel like a teddy in this. Now this sort of material, you know, that like bobbly sort of sheepy material, <laughs> sheepy, <laughs> is not normally the softest, but this one, game changer. This one is so soft. Even my dad felt it and he was like, that is so soft. I know. I love it. I think it's going to add that little pop of colour to your outfit. It's going to keep you super, super warm. I feel like this with a skirt, a little crop top, and maybe some chunky boots would be such a vibe. I don't have one, unfortunately, but I feel like this with a pink skirt, you know, kind of making it look like a cold would look really, really fab. For a coat that's really, really good quality, I'm pretty sure it wasn't even that expensive either, which... And with Black Friday sales, saving them coins. I love it. I'm so excited for it. I was just excited for everything. I'm just excited. Okay, like, let's be real here. Would this be a Jordan Lipscomb clothing haul? without a little bit of camo in it. I'm actually obsessed. I don't think I've done a haul recently that hasn't had camo in. It's a problem. But Miss Pap do these ones, and I don't have any in this color, so I feel like 
it was so fine. How cool are these? These are so funky. Green, orange, and black camo pin trousers. The best part about these is these are more actual like tracksuit bottom trousers. So they're super, super comfortable, but they don't really look like tracksuit bottoms. You could totally wear these out. I feel like this with a little black top or even an orange top would look so cute. They do of course have this drawstring waistband as well. So you know, you can pinch that waist in, which is really, really nice because then it's totally flattering on your figure. They fit really nicely. You know, they've still got a bit of like looseness to them. So they're not as fitted, but they still flatter your figure, which is amazing. That's what we all want because you know, we want to look kind of like chill and kind of cool, you know, with looser bottoms and stuff, but we don't want it to like not be flattering. Otherwise we're just going to look like a pencil but these ones are super super flattering really really comfortable you just can't go wrong i got them in a small i believe yeah a small i love myself some camo trousers i literally have them in green red now this color i'm actually wearing camo right now would you believe it a couple things left from miss pap now next thing is a little skirt i mean look at that color it looks a bit more red on camera it's more of like that orangey kind of color a line skirt with this like black panel down the side with little poppers that do actually you know pop open which i actually really really like because sometimes it's nice to undo the last sort of couple poppers to kind of create like a bit of a slit in your skirt i don't know if you want a bit more leg on show it gives you that option for you to do that it's a really really nice material super super lightweight they had it in loads of other colors as well i went for the orange because i don't have an orange skirt what size did i get you in a size eight stuck to my size and it is a teeny 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 bit too big around my waist nothing crazy i think because i like to wear things super high-waisted that sometimes it's like jordan just just put it down a bit but yeah nothing wrong with adding a little bit of color to your wardrobe a little play suit so first off it's in this amazing like bluey gray velvet and i've said this so many times on my channel but velvet i think makes things look way more expensive so it looks like this it crosses over at the front into little shorts and then the sleeves are really cute they have little bows at the oh picked up my hair as well they have little bows at the bottom and then there's little slit well that's a pretty big slit, Jordan. <laughs> but yeah, there's slits on each arm. You can totally dress this up, dress this down, you know, put a denim jacket with it for the daytime and then maybe put on some heels and like a leather jacket or something for the evening. Done. Play suits are so fab. You put them on and you're like, good to go. And low key, this is like perfect for this time of year, you know, getting into that party season. Like as much as I love my brights, you know, then pops of colors, I've been loving like navies and grays and blacks, you know, like darker colors. I feel like that's just me going into like winter mode, like everything dark, like. <laughs> Pretty sure I stuck to my size with this. Yeah, I got a size eight. Eight. I don't know why I said that so like eight. Next clothing brand now. You know it was gonna come. You know it was gonna come. Pretty little thing close to my heart first thing from them is another little knitwear item to show you but again it's something a little bit different this is definitely more of that like cream ivory kind of color so it has a roll neck i was about to say a roll neck neck nice little crop you know with that sort of like crochet detailing knitwear kind of situation and then on the sleeves it has these little like frilly i don't even know like just this frilly okay i've already planned this outfit this with a black leather skirt give it to me i got it in a size eight and i love how it has that natural sort of like oversized fit to it it's just something really cash and because it has these sort of added bits on it as well it looks like you put way more effort in than you did really we just chucked on a chunky knit like i said chunky knits around this time of year you just can't go wrong oh my god i'm gonna be so snug it's like it's a bug in a rug seeing as i was on pretty little thing i thought i have to try out something from the Kourtney Kardashian collection like how could I not these trousers you've probably seen them on there they are actually a little cord I really really wanted the little top that went with it but they didn't have my size in there they were completely out of stock so I thought you know what I'll ask for the trousers and then I can get like the crop top another time they have this amazing print on like look at these I actually am obsessed I want the top so bad <laughs> they are flared trousers this amazing like soft velvet material i got these in a six they are so flattering they fit perfectly around my waist really really nicely around my bum and then they sort of go down and just flare out only thing a little thing about these they are so long like to the point where i'm like does anybody in this entire universe have legs this long because like, look, guys, you can kind of tell just from me holding up. I don't think I've ever seen trouser legs this long. Even when I stand on my tiptoes and, you know, like, pretend I've got heels on, still too long. I don't really know. I think I'm going to have to, like, take them up, see if I can sort of take them up somehow. Because I really, really want to wear these. I really love them. The colours and everything about it, it just makes floral really wearable. I'm not really, like, a floral kind of gal, you know? But these are on a new level. So I'm going to have to find a way to do it. My mum will probably know 
Did you see the label then? It just like went flying. My mum will probably know what to do. Get mum a lip scum to help me. And then the other Kourtney Kardashian thing I got was the oversized like shirt dress. I got it in black. She did have it in this amazing like pink as well, but black's just sort of like safe for me. Surprisingly, this is actually a lot longer than I thought it'd be, but I love the way she styled it. She had this sort of belt round the waist, which is exactly how I'm gonna style it. The good thing about it being long though is you can kind of like customize the length with a belt, which is fab. It basically just is a black satin, long sleeved shirt dress. There's not much more to say about it really. It is really, really well made though. I got it in a size eight. I probably could have even got a size six to be honest, but I still really, really like it. I actually love shirt dresses. They're such an easy piece to style, but can just look so cool. I think I've said that word about 20 million times in this video, but I just, my vocabulary just can't stretch out right now. <laughs> I've been eyeing this little bodysuit up on pretty little thing for so long now. And I was like, you know what? Just gonna do it. How cute is this? It actually looks tiny on camera. It does fit. Little cami shaped bodysuit, love the square neckline. I think that's so flattering and really, really feminine. Just has pretty little thing. Well, PLT written all over it. Just navy blue and white. This is so simple so effective. <laughs> Pair this with skirts, jeans, trousers, literally anything. Anything will go with this piece, which I love. It's so handy to have super versatile pieces in your wardrobe because then, you know, you'll get like a lot of wear out of it. I got it in a size A. I always do with my bodysuits. You guys know I don't want that whole like double bum cheek thingy going on. Also, just so you know, it is a little popper bodysuit. I've had bodysuits in the past, right guys, that don't open up. I've had to do that whole like pull to the side situation nearly peed on myself and it was in a club as well that wasn't cute this is another little thing that i've been eyeing up for the longest time do you know that's the fun thing about black friday anything that you've been eyeing up now's your time to get it another little jacket but it is different because it is more of a cropped hoodie bloody soft i can tell you that i love how it's cropped i love cropped things i think it's really like flattering on like my shape it has a hood as well which i think is so adorable it's fur too which means it kind of adds a bit of like extraness to you anyway i love the way this feels i love the way this fits i love the way it looks i just love everything about it they had it in loads of other colors as well the one i can remember is baby blue which i was eyeing up as well i really really like that one but i went with black I low-key slash high-key don't want to take this off now. It's too hot right now. When you have like two huge softbot lights in front of you. Ow! Another little satin piece now. There's actually quite a bit of satin in this video. How many? Two more pieces after this that are satin, I think. I honestly don't ever realise until it all gets here and I'm like, oh, did I really order that much of the same material? I don't know. Anyway, the reason why I picked up this white satin shirt was because there was a model on there and she was wearing these white sort of wide leg trousers with this and it looked so so good it's like smart but like cash i don't know i love the fact that it's white it will go with everything i love the fact it's satin as well because it doesn't look like a school shirt or even just like a work shirt i don't know it just has more of a different kind of vibe to it i got it in a small as well obviously if you want it way more oversized than size up but this is more of like that sort of like loose but more fitted kind of look this was definitely more of that like spawny last minute thing you know when you see it and you're like do i get it do i not and then the model just like made me want to get it. You ever have that when the models on the website sometimes make you buy things? <laughs> Literally me all the time. Moving on to another brand now we are going to do In The Style. Again, one of my other favourites. I've just realised you're probably going to look at these and think they look really similar to the Kourtney Kardashian ones, Jordan. Yeah. Another floral pair of trousers, but these are different, I promise. First off, the material is totally different. This is definitely more of that just like chiffony material and these are way more of just like wide leg trousers which i'm obsessed with i love wide leg trousers oh my god do you know what's even better they actually have pockets that's just like made my entire day now i actually size down with wide leg trousers because i know they're going to naturally be bigger and obviously i still want them to kind of look flattering on me these are really nice they have like an elasticated back so you know they like kind of like they do that ding like the elastic thing around your waist they do also sort of like give you you know a little bit of bum shape. I always see trousers like this as a really, really nice evening piece. Especially when it comes to this time of year, you know, you don't always want to be wearing like a little dress with like everything on show. Sometimes you do want to be like a little bit more covered up. So I feel like this sort of vibe is perfect. And you might be thinking, Jordan, isn't this more of like a summery piece? Like, girl, you wear whatever the hell you want when you want. These are actually from the Billy Fairs collection as well. A lot of this stuff is actually like celebs or influencers collections which is really, really nice, showing, you know, my little bit of support. I feel like the next books I have to show you are from the Tammy Hembrow. I think that's how you say her name. Little collection that she has just come out with. 
kind of dying over them. <laughs> She's actually done some really, really nice pieces. I have two little kind of cords here. The first cord I have is oh, that color. I love this kind of champagne gold. Love it. I guess I'm like passionate. I'm like, yes. Surprise, surprise. Wide leg trousers. Am I okay? Honestly, I never realize until I sit down and I'm like, you've got this many pair of wide leg trousers, this much set and stuff, this... I have no words. I'm not even mad at it, to be honest, because these are hella cute. Got the bottoms in a size six, like I said, always, always do, and I'm so, so glad I did. They fit like a dream. There's just like a little bandeau top. What I really like is she's put a little rubberized band at the top, so you know, all us people with not the biggest boobs in the world, put your hands up. This will help to keep this up, because you know, we haven't really got boobs to help keep up, so the rubber is our best friend. I did get an eight, though, in the top, just so you know, it fits, like, wideness-wise. Wide? The other thing I got from her is another satin thing. These though are a totally different material. They feel a lot, lot heavier and they have a bit more like stretch to them as well. Okay, so my camera just decided to like die on me. Thanks camera. So yeah, I got a six in these, but they are a lot more fitted than the like champagne ones. They're tight around my waist and my bum and then as they pass my thighs, they get like looser if that makes sense. But it does come with a little top. It does come with this little bralette top as well. Kind of looks like a little bow in the middle. And then the trousers have that sort of design as well. I love the way that this looks. I love the fact that the trousers are, again, really, really high-waisted. So, you know, you have a little top. So, you not too much going on. But there's a little bit of something going on. You feel me? Super, super happy with these pieces. Again, it's the perfect time of year for stuff like this. Christmas season, party season has come in. We are on to the very last place, a Boohoo. I'm going to, like, switch up real quick and show you a pair of shoes. Look at these boots. Do you not just love them? What really attracted me to these boots were this sort of like gradient heel here, like this sort of chunky heel. It's a suede sock boot. I love sock boots. Surprisingly, they are really, really comfortable. I think it's super, super hard to find sock boots that are really comfortable. These are. They're just something a little bit different. Like I've not seen shoes with this sort of like heel before. I think it's really edgy. They are true to size, Myra 5, and they fit fab. Eh, eh, eh. Oh my God, this dress in the light. <sighs> How amazing is that? I actually just can't stop looking at it in the viewfinder. That is insane. Boohoo, I see you. So it's just a little strappy V-neck front bodycon dress, as you can see. Totally sparkly, totally like glam. They're actually little like sequins, and then obviously when the light reflects off, it looks bomb. Yes, you sound like Christmas. This is so, so nice. Oh, I actually love it. I think this might be my Christmas outfit. I don't even know. So I got this in a eight. But I didn't realise this is actually from the petite section, so it is a little bit short. There's no like bum shots or anything, but it is just that sort of, you know, you kind of have to watch it if you're out dancing and stuff. Which can be a little bit annoying, but when a dress looks this good, I don't even think I really care. You know when you're just like, right, I'm going to risk it for a chalky disc? Because that, that is fire, that is so nice. They may even have a version that's not petite, I don't know, I didn't mean to get a petite one, so that's the first dress. And then the next dress is in this colour, which I have been obsessed with. That sort of like burgundy. Ugh, love it. It's off the shoulder. What a surprise. A little bodycon mini dress, long sleeved, off the shoulder, has this little v-neck, little curl, something a little bit sexy. This is really, really good quality. It has a nice stretch around the shoulder, so you know it's gonna like stay there. It's not gonna ping all about the place. The v at the front is actually wide, so it's gonna like keep its shape. It's in this amazing velvet, but it has a bit of stretch to it, so it's really, really comfortable. They add it in other colors as well. I got the berry kind of wine color because it stood out to me the most. Again, perfect little party dress. Last two things now, so the first one is a coat. Another one. Another one. DJ Kelly. <laughs> Another long line coat, which is surprising for me. Usually I'm a cropped kind of girl, but I've been whipping out the sort of longer coats. I think because these sort of coats I wear with like dresses and stuff, you know, to sort of like match it. Anyway, it's a really, really soft, short kind of faux fur, grey, bluey kind of jacket. Oh, they call it charcoal. That's probably a better way to describe it actually than like bluey grey, but around the waist it has these little bits here which you can like pull in and sort of customise the shape around you if you want to. Has a hood as well. There's not really too much else to say about it really. You can't really go wrong with a bit of fur and a, and a coat. Oh, this is actually from the petite section again. It's not petite though. I got it in a size A and I love this. My mum is even like eyeing up this coat. She said this is her favourite one out of all of them. So mom, if my coat goes missing, I know where it is. JK babes, you can borrow it. And then the last thing, would you look at that? Camo again. This is basically like a sort of shirt 
jacket situation. I feel like this would look so cool, sort of like a band t-shirt dress or just like band tee and ripped jeans. I got this in a medium slash large, by the way, just so it had a bit more sort of like give to it because I like jackets and stuff that have that sort of like oversized feel. It's just like a shirt jackety, like jackety. <laughs> Am I alright? You know, the thin sort of material, but it's just a really good thing to just kind of like throw over, out the door. And we all know camo makes everything better, right? <laughs> There's definitely loads of you out there like, um, no. I have finally shown you guys everything. We have got through this. If you've made it to the end of the video, like literally, high five babe, you done good. You're the best. Hopefully this haul has given you a little bit of inspiration on what you could maybe purchase for Black Friday. You know, when there's sales, we can't help ourselves. I totally get it. So yeah, hopefully this has helped you out a little bit. That's me done. Thank you so, so much for taking the time to watch this video. Um, If you if you do want to subscribe, love to have you here. But yeah, I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you in the next video.